Moto Focus brings you a deep dive into one of the most secretive and ambitious projects in modern military aviation, the 2026 Mikoyan MiG-41. Considered the successor to the legendary MiG-31 Foxhound, the MiG-41 has been surrounded by speculation, classified research, and bold promises from Russian defense industries. It is presented as a sixth-generation interceptor, designed not only to defend Russian airspace but also to project aerial dominance in ways the world has never seen before. As the international balance of power shifts and hypersonic weapons redefine warfare, the MiG-41 emerges as a response to the future of threats in the skies. The Evolution from MiG-31 The MiG-31, which first entered service in the early 1980s, was revolutionary for its time, capable of flying at speeds exceeding Mach 2.8 and intercepting targets at extraordinary ranges. But in the 21st century, its capabilities are becoming outdated against stealth aircraft, long-range drones, and hypersonic missiles. The MiG-41 is not just an upgrade, it is a completely reimagined interceptor designed for 21st century combat. Russian defense circles describe it as a space defense fighter, with missions far exceeding traditional air superiority. In essence, the MiG-41 is the natural evolution of decades of interceptor philosophy combined with cutting-edge aerospace research. Design Philosophy The 2026 MiG-41 is rumored to feature a sleek, stealth-oriented design with advanced radar-absorbing coatings and minimal radar cross-section signatures. Unlike traditional fighters, its airframe emphasizes high altitude, high-speed interception rather than dogfighting agility. Early reports suggest a blend of angular stealth shaping with variable air inlets designed to sustain hypersonic performance. Its configuration prioritizes straight-line speed, fuel efficiency at extreme velocities, and the ability to carry long-range missile payloads. The aircraft reflects Russia's doctrine, intercept first, strike decisively, and retreat before the enemy can respond. Hypersonic Capability At the heart of the MiG-41 project is speed. Russian defense sources claim the aircraft is capable of exceeding Mach 4 and potentially approaching Mach 5 under certain conditions. If these figures are accurate, it would make the MiG-41 the fastest operational fighter in the world. Achieving such speeds requires revolutionary propulsion systems, including rumored scramjet integration or hybrid turbojet ramjet engines. The goal is to create an aircraft that can not only keep pace with hypersonic cruise missiles but also intercept them mid-flight. This makes the MiG-41 not just a threat to enemy bombers and fighters but a potential shield against hypersonic weapons that challenge existing air defenses. Combat Role and Mission Profile Unlike multi-role fighters such as the Su-57 or American F-35, the MiG-41 is built with a singular purpose long-range interception and destruction of high-value aerial threats. Its mission profile is expected to include neutralizing stealth bombers, high-altitude reconnaissance platforms, and hypersonic missiles. Reports even suggest anti-satellite capability, meaning the aircraft could potentially disrupt enemy space-based assets. This transforms the MiG-41 from a traditional fighter into a platform capable of blurring the boundaries between atmospheric and near-space operations. With the inclusion of directed energy weapons and hypersonic missiles, its missions could range from defending Russian skies to enforcing no-fly zones in contested regions. Advanced Weapon Systems The MiG-41's rumored arsenal is as ambitious as its speed. Analysts expect it to carry next-generation long-range air-to-air missiles such as the R-37M and future hypersonic interceptors designed to neutralize both aircraft and missiles. Russian officials have also hinted at the inclusion of directed energy weapons like high-powered lasers to target enemy missiles at extreme distances. Additionally, some reports speculate about the integration of anti-satellite missile systems launched directly from the aircraft's high-altitude envelope. These weapons, if operational, would redefine the scope of what an interceptor can accomplish in modern warfare. Stealth and Survivability while Russia's traditional strength has often been speed and firepower over stealth, the MiG-41 seeks to balance both. Its reduced radar cross-section is designed to make it harder for NATO radars and early warning systems to track, especially at long ranges. Moreover, 
its extreme operating altitude and velocity add natural survivability. Very few current or upcoming fighters could effectively pursue or intercept a MiG-41 in action. Electronic countermeasures, advanced sensors, and radar systems will further enhance its defensive edge. Survivability for this aircraft does not rest on avoiding combat but on dominating it before adversaries can mount an effective response. Sensor and Avionics Suite The 2026 MiG-41 is expected to incorporate cutting-edge sensor arrays, including next-generation AESA, active electronically scanned array, radars capable of detecting stealth targets at great distances. Integration with space-based tracking systems could allow the MiG-41 to share real-time data across Russia's defense network. Avionics will likely emphasize long-range situational awareness, automated interception solutions, and AI-assisted decision-making to handle engagements at hypersonic speeds where human reaction times are insufficient. This fusion of speed and intelligence ensures that the MiG-41 can operate as a central node in Russia's aerial defense ecosystem. Space and Anti-Satellite Potential One of the boldest claims surrounding the MiG-41 is its potential role as a space-capable platform. While not a true spacecraft, Russian sources suggest the aircraft could conduct missions in near-space environments and deploy anti-satellite weaponry. This capability would give Russia a unique strategic advantage in an era where satellites play vital roles in communication, navigation, and surveillance. By threatening orbital assets, the MiG-41 extends its deterrence beyond Earth's atmosphere and signals a new frontier in aerospace warfare. Strategic Impact If fully realized, the MiG-41 will significantly alter the strategic balance between Russia, NATO, and other global powers. For decades, Russia's interceptor fleet has been a cornerstone of its territorial defense, deterring incursions across its vast airspace. The MiG-41 raises this deterrence to a new level by threatening not just conventional aircraft but also space-based infrastructure and hypersonic weapons. Its mere existence could reshape strategic planning, forcing adversaries to allocate more resources toward countering an aircraft they may never be able to catch. Challenges and Skepticism Despite the ambitious promises, the MiG-41 faces enormous challenges. Developing reliable propulsion capable of sustaining Mach 4 plus speeds is a monumental task. Thermal management, fuel consumption, and airframe durability at hypersonic velocities present engineering hurdles that even the most advanced aerospace nations struggle with. Furthermore, Russia's strained economy and ongoing sanctions may limit the resources available for full scale production. Some analysts argue that the MiG-41 may remain more of a prototype and symbolic project than a mass-produced operational fleet. Yet, even if limited in numbers, its psychological and strategic value cannot be underestimated. Comparison with Western Programs In comparison to Western projects, the MiG-41 stands apart in philosophy. While the United States and its allies focus on stealthy multi-role fighters such as the F-35 and 6th generation programs like NGAD, Russia's MiG-41 is a specialized platform for extreme speed and interception. This reflects different strategic priorities. Where the West emphasizes versatility and stealth, Russia emphasizes territorial defense and deterrence through overwhelming speed and firepower. If the MiG-41 achieves its intended capabilities, it will occupy a unique role unmatched by Western designs. Future Prospects As of 2026, the MiG-41 is believed to be in advanced development stages, with prototypes and experimental models under testing. Full operational deployment may take several more years, but its unveiling already sparks intense debate about the future of aerial warfare. Whether it becomes a widely deployed aircraft or a limited strategic deterrent, the MiG-41 represents a bold vision of aerospace power projection. Its role in Russian defense strategy will likely e.